We have had a wonderful life, Mary Beth and I. Oh, yes, we have. And we have wonderful friends, and we have wonderful children, so we've been very fortunate. Yes. This January that just passed, 2013, was 29 years. Say you lived long enough, and next thing you know, bang, bang, boomerang, federally they say, a marriage equality for everybody. What would that mean? That would mean everything. We would have freedom to know that you would be even error. Yes. And that's something that I worry about every single day. And I wish I didn't have that worry because you don't deserve that. No. Somebody. Allergy season. The pollen level's so high. It's okay. They're the best. Best moms. Best parents I could have ever asked for. If their marriage was recognized, we would have so much more relief. Mary that's been working since 1974. She's been paying her taxes. She's a very responsible citizen. She's paid into Social Security and paid into Medicare, and, and that money is just disappearing just doesn't seem right. Allowing same-sex couples the freedom to marry in Pennsylvania uh, and nationally would allow them to protect each other and their families. When one spouse of a same-sex couple passes, the other spouse can be hit with serious inheritance tax bills. It can take a serious financial toll on the family. You know, this family is based on love. They're the longest couple I know to have been together, you know. My husband and I take a lot of stuff for granted in the sense that if my husband died, there's a social security benefit that I would get. And for as big or as small as it may be, it's pretty helpful. And that won't happen for them. It just would have been very important to have them as a married couple. Their love and the memories, that is greater than what the state says. But. I really wish that they had had that. Truthfully, we've been married 29 years. It's just that nobody else knew it. So, Mary Beth is my wife.